have what we're going to have. Go ahead and get started. It's five after. Um, uh, most important thing today is that we, the Testylvania region, which is there for party viewers to do compatibility testing with, is now running uplifted. That is, it is running in AWS, not low. Um, it is believed to be feature complete. Appreciate any testing that bug reports you can file. Um, it would be super helpful to find things early. Um, so have at. If you need access to uh, to Testylvania and haven't got it, talk to uh, Kyle or Maestro or Mazdox. They can take care of it for you. Yes, thank you, Whirly. Um, so, um, very big deal. Uh, we we currently have uh, several dozen regions running uplifted, some of them resident accessible and some not. Uh, we will be ramping that up over the next few weeks. Uh, and at some point, we will begin moving the regular RCs there, but we're not we're not quite ready for that yet, due to backend considerations that shouldn't def shouldn't affect users directly, but shouldn't is one of those terrible words that we that are one of the ways you can ask for trouble when you're talking about computer programs is by saying it shouldn't do something. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, right. You're closed. It shouldn't happen. Uh, so I will turn the meeting over to Veer for discussion of the viewer pipeline, which has not stopped despite uplift. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, so we've got a uh, big development in viewer land this week with the release of Love Me Render. That's um, that's our kind of follow-on to EEP uh, viewer that has a bunch of high-priority graphics fixes um, that had been uh, kind of highlighted as a particular concern uh, by a bunch of folks. I think uh, I think we got most of those and. Um, so that is out now. Um, always curious to hear how things are going. The graphics folks are getting into looking at some interesting longer-term architecture things now, and um, that's all good. The next promotion we're seeing now is probably going to be the mesh uploader viewer. Um, we probably won't put that out next week just because uh, we've been we did consecutive weeks recently already and it's a pain to deal with all the merges. Um, but uh, we'll we'll see what the call is on that. Um, so Mesh Uploader has some fixes that originally or some some UI improvements that originally brought in from Firestorm as well as some homegrown UI improvements that. Uh, that we've got for getting better information about error messages and uh, better feedback about uh, mesh rigging. Um, so that stuff should all be going out soon. Um, other than that, we have the usual train of uh, maintenance uh, fixes. We're also going to be starting a series of viewers with uh, changes that are specifically specifically targeting UI changes, trying to uh, improve the user experience, make some, hopefully make some of our longstanding quirks a little less quirky and uh, the experience a bit smoother for folks. So uh, Steelto recently has been spending a lot of time looking at the, the UX side of things and the, the product of those deliberations will be this uh, 
sequence of, uh, of UI change viewers. Um, let's see. Other than that, we've got some viewers that are on hold for one reason or another. The Legacy Profiles viewer is waiting on some more attention from the web team who are basically uh, committed to uplift right now. Let's not really have time to look at that. And let's see, what else do we have? Let's see, we have a project viewer for custom key mappings. Um, haven't seen a lot of feedback on that one. Hopefully it's going well, in which case that one will probably be going to RC in the not too distant future. Um, and other stuff is farther out. Uh, probably won't be showing up uh, showing up beyond the project viewer stage for a while, but we will keep you posted as things develop. So floor is open for issues, questions, concerns, whatever. Yeah, the uh, the arm is an interesting one. We're still in the process of trying to get a hold of an arm dev testing box, Apple, and uh, are very interested to see what that whole process is going to look like once we uh, once we have that. Yeah, we don't really have anything to announce now, except that you know we're we're aware of the issue and are be looking into it. We have not attempted to build for ARM yet, but.
we going to end up with a super short meeting today? How are imports of EAP functionality going out there? The love me render fixes, that is. Well, if we don't have anything to talk about, no sense in just sitting here. It's Friday afternoon, after all. Thanks for coming, everybody. You know where to find us. Yep. Well, thank Thanks, you. Everyone.